So, Yenif, okay, um, I am worried about the um, referendum for the Eighth Amendment and getting the legislation through on time. And we've consistently made the argument that we need to uh, ensure that we get an early referendum. And I know uh, Antishak agrees with me on this. But we have been delayed because of the outcome of the Supreme Court case and indeed the business office told me that the barristers were delayed because of the snow. Now if we're going to rise here on Thursday evening and not return till the 20th of March, what guarantees do we have that we have enough time to get this over the line so that we can have an early referendum for students and the young people etc. The consistent argument that we've made and in the case that there is no guarantee of that if we're pressed for it, I'd like to ask the House to sit again on Friday Friday and sit late if necessary and if necessary come back next week. After all we've been off since last Wednesday and we're going to have an Easter break shortly as well and I think we owe this to the people of Ireland to ensure that we have an early referendum and in particular to the young people of Ireland who've been campaigning extremely hard for it. I quite agree with Deputy Smith on this, uh, on this matter. Um, the Supreme Court is going to deliver its judgment in Limerick tomorrow uh, and um, uh, the Business Committee is going to meet uh, at 4.30 today. Uh, as a result of that, um, we will be requesting um, that the all meet on Friday, because uh, we would like to have a Cabinet meeting on Thursday to approve uh, the wording of the referendum, the policy paper associated with it, so that we can have it in the Dáil on Friday, uh, establish the Referendum Commission formally on Friday. Uh, and if we do not do that, we will lose about 10 days, uh, and that does jeopardise um, our uh, ambition to have a referendum uh, before the end of May. So I would ask for the cooperation of all parties in this House uh, to allow us to meet on Friday for that purpose. And I would ask parties to work together to make sure that there is a quorum. Um, I know it's the norm that the government is supposed to provide the quorum, but this, is, this does arise from an all-party committee report. And I would ask all parties to be willing to uh, help provide a quorum uh, for Friday.